Good afternoon, everyone. This is Tyler Blankenship coming from you from Camping World out of Rossford, Ohio. Today, I have the pleasure of showing you this beautiful 2020 Mallard M32, right? Um, fiberglass cap, rock guard finish, as you see right off uh, rip. You do have slam proof magnetic pass through storage doors. That is a grill that is included in this one. Exclusive little uh, package. You have your exhaust for your water heater, your refrigerator. Um, this is your city water connect, your tank uh, flush, and then you come in the back here. Again, you have the magnetic slam proof latches on here for this huge outdoor kitchen. And with this outdoor kitchen, uh, it does come with storage, obviously for goodies. It does have a light switch as well. Um, you have a sink inside of here. You do have a area to put a, um, a grill used as a cutting board or whatever the case could be. Obviously, like I said, that grill is included, so that is a place you can put it there. Um, inside of here, you have a uh, not so many mini fridge. Obviously, you can store uh, plenty of beverages. A little storage there too, as well. Right, shut this monster. Again, like I said, slam proof. Um, shuts in there pretty well. On the awning, you do have a one-touch awning uh, with LED lights all the way on the bottom, as you can see um, underneath there. You can see the LED lights a little bit. Uh, obviously, with that, it's a huge benefit when it comes to having people over at night. Um, you know, obviously, as you can see, um, you don't have to worry about the bugs or anything uh, attracted to the inside. It's on the outside of it, so that's definitely a, a benefit. Coming inside, um, right away you can see that we do have a little bit of storage in there with a hanging rack. Some more storage above the bed as well. A little bit of storage underneath the actual uh, bed itself. It does have plug-ins on both sides as well. Um, that way you obviously can charge electronics. You have a little book cubby. Um, you have areas you can put a tablet or even a uh, small reading device. This does have the capabilities of swiveling on this TV, which is awesome. It obviously uh, makes sure that you guys don't have to worry about um, having an additional TV. You have to make sure the doors are shut. When you do this, but it is a cool little feature because as you see, right now, this is where your TV would go, right? And then when you flip it, you now have a nice little wall and obviously the TV on the other side. So it makes it very convenient. Um, when you have guests or anything of that nature, you don't have to worry about having multiple different TVs to entertain everyone. Um, on this entertainment center as well, you do have your uh, Huron radio system here. Uh, it has indoor, outdoor zone control. Uh, obviously, if you had the little ones in here sleeping in the back um, and you want the music on the outdoors, you can put just the outdoors or the indoors or vice versa. So. Again, you have the privacy doors on this one as well. Kind of give you both sides of it. Give you the privacy everyone would be looking for. Out here. So this is a sofa sleeper. Uh, so what that means, I can actually demonstrate it quickly for you. Hopefully my angle's right. There we go. It's getting a little hot. Spring's coming. Weather's getting nice, guys. Um, so, with the sofa sleeper, it's really nice. Pick these up very easily, right? Really quickly, very easily. Um, and then actually, you pop this out, right? So this comes out, it has legs on the bottom that kick here. Right? This goes down, boom, bam. Blame. Thank you, man. So you put the pillows back on, obviously use them as um, like a headrest, but 
a little bit larger than obviously the trifold um, gives you a lot more sleeping space for a person like me that's you know above six foot I'd be able to actually sleep on these compared to maybe some of those uh, trifold beds that we have as well but regardless Fold those back in, fold that back in, goes down, bingo, bango, perfecto. And what was that? 30 seconds? Done. 30 seconds, something like that, not too long, right? Um, obviously gives you another know, sleeping spot. Dinette's very similar, uh, drops down onto those little pegs right there. Um, and once that drops down, then you obviously have another bed as well. But this is a super a, U, a super U uh, dinette, which gives you the middle section, which normally on a regular dinette, you have this section and this section, right? So you have a little bit more space there. Obviously get a couple more people in there. You do have some storage underneath here as well. And then this one does have a 10 foot cubic Dometic fridge. I mean, you can see it's one of the larger ones. Boom, 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 boom. Cool. Um, and then you do have the splash pack back here with the triple uh, stove top, LED lights, if you want to show off for the guests. Um, then obviously gives you light inside of the oven as well. But these backsplash are really nice. Obviously you don't want to, you know, you don't want to ruin this, this um, the wall back there, the, the fixture, if you will. So that just makes sure that you don't have any grease or oil or anything uh, popping on that wall. You do have twin sinks here, which is definitely nice. Clean and dirty dishes or allowing yourself to still be able to clean your hands with the sink full of dirty dishes. Graystone microwave here. All right, fit a full size dinner plate inside of there very large storage area with removable removable uh shelves which then turns into a closet obviously if you want to remove all the shelves um it does have a hvac in here a road vac um with attachments obviously it makes it very convenient when you know you have the kids running around all over the place and you can just sweep everything back here attach it boom 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 done 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 right coming to the bathroom big benefit of this trailer uh it does have a door um into the bathroom so it has an entry point inside of the bathroom and inside of the actual living area that means when the kids are you know making a mess running out in the dirt dogs are doing whatever you know you don't have to worry about taking the whole family through the entire coach you just have to take them through the bathroom makes it a lot more convenient right uh tub in here so obviously if you have young children uh you can still keep the daily tasks uh skylight in here as well medicine cabinet Bingo, bingo. Um, you do have a, some linen space underneath there as well. Um, you do have that oh, plastic. And then up here, this is where you're going to check all your levels. Um, it's obviously very convenient there. Um, you can see exactly, you know, hey, what's my battery at? Oh, we're two thirds full, so on and so forth, right? And obviously, the electric and the uh, gas water heater pump are back there as well. So when it comes to the back of here, so right away, obviously you see this is a separate bunkhouse. Uh, so this is their own little area for the kids. Uh, that this bed right here does pop up. Um, you do have the cubed uh, den in the bottom. Like I said, this one does pop up. So if you wanted to just have a little hangout area watching TV, you'd be able to do that. Or you can obviously have an additional sleeping spot. Um, you're going to have 300 pounds max on this one right here. You're looking at 200 pounds on this one. Uh, obviously on the den, you can put as much weight as possible. Storage all inside of here, underneath, and a hanging rack inside of there as well. So obviously, all the extra storage with all this uh, all the family members that are going to be inside of a coach like this uh, is a big benefit. Um, other than that, um, I believe that covered a majority of things. If you guys have any questions about anything on this video or if you'd like more information, uh, my information will be um, underneath the link in this video. 
I will have my personal, my office, and my email. So whatever way is most convenient, feel free to reach out at any time. So I'm always available. Other than that, guys, I hope this really helped, and happy camping.